The theme of Do Your Part, Be Cyber Smart is shedding a light on the individual responsibilities we all have to keep our digital world secure. NCDIT officials say following the hashtags Be Cyber Smart and Cyber Secure NC can help you protect yourself from cyber attacks. I asked security experts who's at risk for cybersecurity threats. It's a simple one word answer, everybody. Experts like senior cybersecurity architect Mike Parsons says those at most risk are the senior population, kids, and those in low economic situations. People with economic disadvantage because they don't have the uh, ongoing use of, of technology, uh, don't understand things that are outside of the norm as easily. Experts tell me it's better to be suspicious while online than ignorant and unaware. Rob Main is the interim state chief risk officer with the NCDIT. He says the COVID-19 pandemic has exasperated cyber threats with more people utilizing the internet. He says it's busy times of the year and in times of uncertainty and disaster that scammers find opportunity. Whether it be tax filing season or the you know Christmas holidays, Thanksgiving holidays, attackers attempt or always attempt to use um, a seasonal event as a means by which they can trick people into falling for their scams. Phishing attacks, vishing attacks, or uh, smishing attacks. With COVID, the things that we are seeing are vaccine scams or um, testing scams, things along those lines. Things that are very topical and at the top of everybody's mind. Phishing is in the form of scam emails asking for your information or response. Vishing is voice phishing or scam calls. And submission is the use of SMS or text in an attempt to scam. But your mouse is your friend. Parson says your mouse can find out a lot for you without compromising your device. Simply gliding your mouse over links or hot links allows you to see where the original URL came from. Maine says it's important to talk to your kids and elder family members who might not understand the risks and challenges in front of them while online. Ask questions about how they use the internet, what sites they look at, put tools in place and educate them on how to spot a threat. Cybersecurity is everyone's responsibility. The NCDIT will provide tips and best practices on social media all month long. To see those, again, you can follow the hashtag BeCyberSmart and CyberSecureNC. In Greenville, I'm Emily Severage, 9 on your side.